in the morning. Hi people, this is Nettie again. Okay, what I'm going to talk, I'm going to talk about savings. Yeah, how to save a couple of bucks. Okay, um, as you know, Puerto Rico is very expensive. And you only have a minimum of seven, seven well, um, seven twenty-five an hour. That's about it. You know, the majority, the poor folks make. <laughs> They're poorer than us, but at least that's what they call the middle class. Which we're not really middle, middle. We just got luck. Like for instance, I don't pay rent because my mother had an inheritance and she decided to leave it to me. So, you know, between my brother and her, you know, and then they take the top of the house. So that's how, you know, I got lucky. And that's why I don't pay anything, you know, concerning with rent or mortgage. Okay, so saying that, I also had a bill when I first got here of $175 a month. I loaded down to 30 uh, this last bill came $39. How did I do that? I changed all the light bulbs to the, the ones that are, you know, en energy savings. All of them. My outside ones. Every single one. There's not even one regular light bulb. Okay. Not only that. After I finished washing dishes and cleaning up the kitchen and do, done everything. And that's like around 8, 9 o'clock at night. Everything is shut off. Every single light. And I only have my bedroom light. And that's when I'm over there answering letters. I'm checking new clients, whatever. So, um, how you call it? Then I, I don't waste a lot of light. Also, I shut off the, you know, the little light bulbs that comes from the microwave, the TV. All that is shut down, too. From there, I saved $40. I didn't know that. $30 to $40. And that's great. And now I save even more. I also, uh, we have these things, the wall, you know, the wall things that you could shut your, the line of, um, let's say you want to shut off the bedroom. Totally the bedroom because nobody's using it. You click it there and you shut off the whole bedroom. Or you could shut off part of it. You know, the lights or whatever. Uh, we couldn't shut off the lights because the two bedroom lights that are my kids. Because it's attached to my light. So there we couldn't. But all the switches in the bottom, we, we were able to shut all that off. Uh, we shut off a lot of things that we don't use in the living room. You know, switches that we don't use. So we shut all that out. That saved us a couple of bucks also. It's never that light is never being used, you know, so I get a percentage over that. And this is how I shut down all my light bill from a 175 to 38 and 39 dollars. The most I got since I've been doing this is 40 dollars, the most. And I think it was like two times. Okay, so that's a that's a savings. Um, I have another savings. You know, you put these towels, you know, so when your visitor comes, oh, I need to brush my mouth, clean my mouth. Do you have a towel? You know, one of these um, paper towels. And you never have. Because every, the member family, they instead of taking one, they take like a whole stack of them just to clean a little wet thing in the hands or whatever, and they throw it out. And I decided to solve that problem. I buy them, lock it up, Nobody uses it in the house, and I use these. These are, I think these are towels like for um, mechanics. You know, they use like to wash cars and things. But these are strong. These, you use them. You, re you could rewash them and use them again. So why wouldn't I do that? Why would I just clean something up in my kitchen and then throw it out? So I decided to buy one of these. I said, no, I'm going to buy one of these. You know, because you use uh, whatever cloth you use and then it starts stinking and nasty. You know, I throw them, then I, start, I end up throwing them out. These, I could use them two or three times, depending what I'm using it for. Two or three times, and then I throw them out. And I don't have sticky, smelly cloth or anything like that. And it's reusable, you know. So this has lasted me like a couple of months already because... I use these like mainly to dry the the dishes, clean a little, you know, dry the stove or whatever. But 
they're good. So if you want to save a couple of bucks on towels, use these for the house. And make your kids use these. You want to dry your hand, use one of these. And you rewash them, put them to dry, and use them again. So saying that, <laughs> size saving on certain fruits, vegetables, like I save in eggplants. And now my mother uh, planted some papayas. And I got some plantains, and I got some bananas, and I got, I have this. If anybody knows what it is, I don't know what it is. But I bought it inside. It's very beautiful. My mother left me this, and it was getting too dried out outside. And I find it kind of cute, so I bought it inside. I think it's some sort of fruit, but I don't know. And I got my garlic, you know. I got a few things. I got my pigeon peas, uh, strawberries coffee plant, rosemaries, uh, white basil. I got a whole bunch of things, you know, in one small spot. But, how you call it? That's how I've been saving. So, you know, you save a little here, you save a little there, you save a little here, you save a little... You'll be saving a lot of books right now. From 175 I bought my, my light bill to $38. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, I'm not complaining. Because, you know, money is very, very tight. You know what I mean? So, you know, you got to pay the light, the water, air, this, that. You know, it's a lot. So, um, saying this, God bless you all. And see you next time. Bye-bye.